Hello everybody, it's Everaltable 4 for another episode of Super Mario RPG. In the last episode we entered Bowser's castle and we started going through all these doors. Uh, this is Jim Morrison, was, was number one. That's that's the puzzle course. Um, just to clarify something, because people are probably going to tell me about it in between episodes, but uh, uh, the puzzle courses both give you rock candies and the other courses both give you the ultimate weapons for different characters. So hopefully I'm going to enter the battle course over here, because that'll give us Bowser's ultimate weapon as opposed to uh, Peach's not ultimate weapon, because we already got hers. So hopefully this is not an action course. But... If it is, I can fail! Guess what I'm gonna do? I mean, I guess I could also just go for the items. Like a fright bomb. It's a pipe bomb! Ow. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! There we go. What do we got here? Ice bomb! Oh boy! Uh... Yeah, actually I want to get rid of that mid mushroom also. What do we got here? A rock candy! Uh... You know, let's... Yeah, I'm just... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... Self-quit! Aside from the fact that it's like, do you see where it's starting me? I'm not even on the platform. This area of the game is kind of messed up, guys. But uh, yeah, I want to do the battle course. Because <laughs> uh, I want to get Bowser's ultimate weapon, because I think he deserves it, honestly. Oh, nobody ran away. Brave so Robin ran away. He bravely ran away away. Yeah, but I'm gonna have to do real battles now because I'm out of terrorize. Bass is scaring the monster. Oh, there we go. Okay, I guess it just has to be their turn. Brave, brave, brave terracotta. When Bowser reared his ugly head, it bravely turned his tail and fled. Bravely, ta brave Terracotta ran away. He bravely ran away, away. Terracotta ran away. He bravely ran away. Terracotta. It's not a good day unless you can quote Monty Python in some way, especially Monty Python: The Holy Grail. It's just the day hasn't been worth it if you can't do that. It's just how it goes. It's just how it goes. Oh no, Bandito. Oh, these are new enemies. A Sacket and a Big Bertha. Oh, oh, bye. Wow, that killed it. I'm so surprised. Yeah, surprise of surprises. The Big Bertha's... Wow, that was awful. That was bad timing, Gobi. The Big Bertha shoot at bullet bills, or bullet guys. I don't know. Blazer? Was that insta kill? Yes, it is! That was rude, okay? Luckily, Peach is fine! I don't, I don't think I even need to heal her. Ever. No, oh, no, not canines! Forkies are enraptured. Oh, I'm sorry, Chow. Yeah, but these are the ones from uh, from the past. Oh no. Uh. <laughs> One damage. Wow, 192. That's it. I'm surprised. I am surprised. Okay, let's so kill him and howl. Howling like a wolf. Oh no, Mario's feared. He's only gonna do 150 da or 230 damage. Oh no! Oh no! Actually, um, you can use a royal syrup just because Peach does have to heal herself, so. Yeah. Or I could have used the flower box, honestly. But we already have plenty of, uh,. Royal syrup, so I kind of want to go through them first. Bowser Crush! Why? 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 Yeah, I, 
guess it was kind of waste. Yay! Vigor up! That's not gonna help you at all. I'm about to smack you in the face. Yeah! Oh, only 60, wow. I'm impressed. But you're still dead. Mallow's level 23! Eh, why not? We'll give him magic. I took the experience booster every off of everybody. It's not really necessary, necessary anymore. I was doing it again! I was saying necessarily. Hey. Rude. Stop it. Okay. Um, let's use Ultra Flame. Oh my god! Did you did you see that? Five hundred over five hundred damage. Oh. Okay, you. I'm definitely. I can just crush you. I will crush you like melon between thighs. Yay! Oh no, not the geckets. Do 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 do. Bowser versus Donkey Kong. Caution, confused monster. Caution, confused monster. I was really hoping it would it would kill Donkey Kong for me. Sorry. Could have sworn that was the second room, but I don't know. I guess I'm just not paying enough attention. rob -om. You cost me a question, sir. Kaboom! Boom! Splurge. Huh. Oh. Ba boom Critical! No. <laughs> oh. Wow! Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Okay. Wonderful. And Bowser levels up! Yay! Yeah, why not? <laughs> Oh, that was an interesting sound. That was like a... Oh, hey. Um, let's use poison gas because they just die from anything. Or take them out of... <laughs> Yay! It's the guys that get killed by mute. I love it. Oh, it's the, the magma or whatever they're called. Magmus. I'm Magmus! Uh, the other guy is a pulsar. Which is a type of star! Why? Wow! That was a nice amount of damage. I'm impressed. And one more. <laughs> is that a mimic? It is! Wow! Chester! <laughs> Oh, my little brother's gonna enjoy seeing that. Okay. Uh, are you weak to jump? I totally forgot. Yeah, you are. And they summon monsters. You are Bahamut. Oh, square. Oh, square. Uh, yeah, no, no, no. Give yourself a hug, Peach. Uh, all right, you kill Bahama, and you're gonna jump on the chest again. <laughs> Bahamut, 
sandstorm. Oh no. Oh no, I got I got peach coming up though, so just undo that. A group hug. Yay! Uh, yeah. An actual real fight that I have to care about. What a what a what a concept. But that's the end of that. Two hundred coins. And for all that we get the drill claw. If we would have gotten the other action course, we would have gotten like the slap glove or something like that. I don't remember what it's what it's called exactly, but it's Peach's semi ultimate weapon without buying the uh, the frying pan. But let's give Bowser his drill claw. Very nice. And, uh, let's see where this leads us. <laughs> ah, no. Yeah. Leads us to a save point, which I'm actually gonna use because I didn't get a chance to save in between episodes. So we're gonna go there. And... Let's use... Let's use a flower box. Okay. Everybody was all healed up, but it doesn't- I don't care. Hey there! This is Smithy's castle. No trespassers allowed! And now it's time for mini-boss time with the Magikoopa! And yeah, you just have to press the timing right as Bowser's about to do the first swing there, and... This guy really shouldn't be- I think he has about 1500 health or so? Uh, but he's really not much of a, a, a problem to us at this point. Uh, yeah, just therapize him. Give Bowser a nice hug, Peach. Keep missing the timing. Yeah, so now Bowser and Mario are, like, the powerhouses. This is the reason why... A Yoshi egg. This is the reason why I had Bowser in my party in previous playthroughs of the game, just because, hey, no cheating, um, just because Bowser does get to be a physical tank, and that's really the type of character that I looked for in video games in general, so yeah, I, I like Bowser a lot, and even if his magic stinks, ha, um, the, I don't know, he just, he's, uh, really really solid character otherwise and yeah that was kind of pathetic honestly i like that peach got the final blow okay 10 and 10. we'll switch back to gino after we liberate bowser's castle though Ajakupa. and yeah now happy music huh where am i bowser hello how have you been i uh made it back here somehow but it seems i've been brainwashed or something yeah yeah sure can't seem to remember anything. Have I done something wrong? Uh, don't worry about it. Let's just put it behind us. It's great running into a loyal Koopa Trooper like you. I'm glad. It looks like you got some tough new troopers now, but my magic can still help you out. Watch this. Ho kala This magic treasure box will never run out of coins. Just keep on hitting it. I'll be here if you need me. Come by whenever you rejuvenate your HP and magic. So yeah, um, this will give you an infinite amount of coins, which is kind of cool, I guess, if you want to try to make your way out of Bowser's castle somehow. I don't know, but he also heals you, so that's pretty cool. Uh, so let's go onward from here, and we got Croco. Just remember, I can't always be coming to your rescue. Oh, there ain't any more you need, best boy, now. Yeah, once again. Oh, yeah, now we have upgraded uh, armor for everybody. Just kind of awesome. The hero shirt, the prince pants, the star cape, the heel shell, and the royal dress. All legendary items. Uh, okay, we only have room for one, so let's equip things. Uh, so the fire shirt, so the hero shirt's gonna increase uh, both those things. I did not need to buy you the royal dress, but it's not terrible, I guess. Prince pants and the star cape. All right. 
And yeah, if you can't buy any of those, just keep hitting the treasure box. See ya! Well, that's nice of him. I do like Croco kind of reforms at the end of the game there and helps us out for realsies. Like, it's not a trap or anything. Like, he's actually, like, he actually wants to help us. Okay. Forgot if there's eh, something I wanted to do, but... Uh, yeah, we have more Big Berthas here. Which, I don't know why you fight the Big Bertha if you run into the... Uh, bullet Bill, but whatever. Just hit him with a frying pan. And now that we have the Drill Claws, the battles are going to be a little bit easier. And once we switch back to Gino, he'll have his uh, Star Gun, so that's pretty cool. It's a gun similar to the one he had at the beginning of the game. Uh, I don't remember if there's anything on top of those, but I don't really care. And yeah, now you want to get yourself prepared because mini boss is coming up. Or, I don't know, it's kind of a castle boss creature. <laughs> I like the, the Kinklinks are now shy guys. It's a nice little touch. So you are the notorious Mario. I'm impressed you admitted this far. I didn't think you could. Hello. Oh, feisty little fellow, aren't you? But this is the end of the line. Now you've got to deal with me. I got For boss time against Boomer. And no, you can't target the shy guys this time. But yeah, Boomer is an um, interesting character. Well, not interesting, but he's got some tacks up his sleeve. Uh, what we're going to be doing is just beating him up, wailing on him. Um, yeah, he he has a few he has a few interesting attacks, but nothing that we should really be worried about. Uh, we're just gonna keep Peach doing weak attacks. Actually, I could have Peach using Mystery Egg on him, uh, or the Star Egg, I should say. Um, Bowser's uh, attacks are pretty much worthless. Uh, his magic attacks are pretty much worthless against this guy. Um, obviously, if you have Geno, just have Geno use. Uh, you know, boost and then also go, I would say, go on the offensive there. Uh, let's heal up Bowser. Keep missing the timing. Okay. 139, and yeah, Mario is just gonna annihilate him. Yeah, so halfway through his HP, he's going to turn blue! And I believe that his, that makes his defense go up. Ba da ba dee da ba die da ba dee da ba die. Sorry. Shake it! Shake it like a Polaroid picture. Hundreds better than 39. Better than a sharp stick in the eye, as they say. 312. Okay, so. Did your. Oh, yeah, I forgot. He has an insta kill. <laughs> shaker. Salt shaker. Except Mario... is Mario... Uh, does the Quartz Charm protect against that? I don't know. I don't know if it protects that or he just missed. But um, let's bring Peach back because we don't want to have him use Shaker against other people and then get into a, a Deathlock situation. 62 and that's it. Yay! Ah! I love this. It's like the... the... The no music. This is absurd. I can't be defeated by them. I won't let this happen. I won't fall in battle. <laughs> having an attack. <laughs> He's having like a, a an asthma attack. I don't need your sympathy. I am a soldier. I am prepared to go. Take a dive. Chandelier. Yeah! See you later, kids. Boomer! Oh, poor Boomer. But not to worry. A little fall isn't gonna hurt you. Alright, Mario. I'll lead you to the top. We must hurry to a pointed place. That's a weird thing. Hang on tight. Uh... There is a bonus for having Gino in your party before fighting Boomer in that he will be able to use Whirl, uh, Gino Whirl, up against uh, part of the boss coming up. I love this, like, 
happy music. Everybody starts dancing. We got this. Yay, we did it. We rescued Bezos Castle. Increasing speed. It's a tall castle. Next up, the top floor. Please fasten your seatbelts and wait a sec, there are no seatbelts! <laughs> oh, and we get 19 experience. But yep, now it's time for boss time! Against Exor, the sword that crashed into the castle in the first place. Okay, so yeah, so we have Exor up there, which is the main one that we want to fight. We have the Neo Squid, which. I believe is the mouth and the left eye and the right eye. I think the right eye you can use Gino Whirl on for some reason. I don't know why, but uh, we're just going to beat them all up. Uh, yeah, but like Exor at the top is is the one that you want to uh, to really go after, and the everything else gets attacked and it's kind of annoying. I just like how stupid the entire thing looks, but I don't know. Exor is is the first real enemy that that we like ran into in the game, so it's kind of nice that um, you know we are finally able to confront him. Yeah, so he doesn't really. Exor's protection is gone. Okay, we got rid of one of the eyes, which means that we can attack Exor, who I believe has two thousand health, two thousand health. But I guess we'll see. Did about 200 so far. Uh, mute Mario. We'll fix that a little later. Um, this guy's kind of like safer Sephiroth in that uh, uh, you know you have one main part, which I guess is the core. The head is the core. The eyes are the wings, and the mouth is is the head portion. I don't know. Um, and if you kill one part, then the defense on the head portion goes down, and and um, the other parts do come back eventually. So I honestly don't know why I never saw the connection to, to Safer Sephiroth before, but it's definitely that's definitely just a thing. Safer Sephiroth is actually Exor. Not Safer Sephiroth. Bizarro Sephiroth. Dovi. Ah, Dovi, you're so stupid sometimes. Seriously, like, I don't know. He he just says things and he doesn't listen. Yeah, I'm talking about Dovi in the third person now. He says things and he doesn't listen, and it just makes him look like a complete idiot. Sometimes if he's lucky, he catches himself. Like, at MAGFest, I'm pretty sure I was having a conversation with a guy that walked up to me who was wearing the same uh, Zelda hoodie that I was. I'm pretty sure I said Hyrule Warriors instead of Triforce Heroes when I was trying to talk about how we need a third link and he used those, like the guy started giving me confused expressions I'm pretty sure that I was saying Hyrule Warriors and like I didn't realize it and like a week later I was going over the conversation in my head and like I would, my mind was filling in Hyrule Warriors as what I said and I was just like oh god Dovi did you really like you made yourself look like an idiot in front of a complete stranger who was like trying to trying to uh uh, point out that the both of you are wearing awesome hoodies and it was just I, I felt so stupid Yeah, this this I uh, yeah that I had less HP so please don't put us to sleep again That really didn't do much did it Yeah I like I like Mario World. But yeah, so I'm just trying to to ignore the fact that I was saying safe for Sephiroth instead of Bizarro Sephiroth, and he's dead. And when you kill him, the mouth opens and sucks you in. Yeah, now Exor is just dead. I don't know. It's creepy. Creepy. And Gino levels up. Whoop whoop. Toad dice. Um, no, 
Let's give you attack. Oh boy. And now we are inside. Oh wow. You don't see many flat pictures like that in this game. Do you know where this leads to? It looks like Exor's the contact between the two worlds. In other words, if we follow this road, we'll find Smithy. So, what's keeping us? Hang on. Hey, I only joined so I can get my castle back. I'm not going to be dragged along on this stupid hunt. This is as far as I go. I'm going to gather my troops and rebuild my castle. And you, Mario, you're an official member of the Koopa Troop. It's your duty to help with the repairs. <laughs> Bowser, you're completely missing the point. Oh, I don't rip your stuffing out. He's a wooden doll. I don't know. No, think about it, Bowser. This sword connects the two worlds, right? Yeah, so? Even if we, even if we defeat Exor, there will be other weapon beasts to follow him. Your castle is at the entrance point to your world. In short, they'll be back. Is that what you want? Uh, well... Um... More weapon things coming to take over my castle. What about my privacy? I have to be able to watch anime. Oh, this isn't good at all. In fact, this stings. But I can't just be pals with these cretins. I've got an image to keep up. Uh, well... I've got it. <clears throat> no one insults the Koopa Troop and gets away with it. I've got a bone to pick with the smithy guy. Come on, Mario, we'll teach him a lesson. I'm so sly. <laughs> uh, looks like we're together in this one. Let's go. In the next episode, also, now we can leave Exor. And it's a point, the gate. Uh, so now we can actually go back to the keep and re and go back to those number rooms and we'll be able to get the last two uh the last two uh, super weapons or uh, not super weapons but last two good weapons but anyway i'm gonna switch gino back into the party before i forget and uh, i'm gonna end off the episode here so in the next episode we're just gonna go on the two final paths there and uh then we shall go into the gates into smithy's realm and uh kill everything and uh, yeah, we're getting close. We're not up to the finale yet, but we are getting there. It's exciting, isn't it? So this has been Sephiroth Level 4. Falling into the lava, like usual. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.